welcome to the interactive body balance radio show for health and fitness tips. All right, here we go. Welcome back to Interactive Body Balance Radio. I'm your host, Mike Dasik, and thank you guys for joining our show today from all over this world where we talk health, fitness, nutrition, and personal development. I believe the show is going to air on January 31st, 2021. Wow, the years are just going by. It is the middle of the winter solstice up here in Canada. Literally, it is freezing cold, and uh, the kids are playing in the backyard rink. Everyone knows it's the COVID pandemic. Uh, so, you know, we're making the best of it, right? You know, training, working out, playing outside, reading, doing these podcasts for you people uh, because you guys are awesome and I appreciate you tuning into the show. And, and literally, I don't know, it's just, it's we're blessed and thank you. And uh, I literally just text somebody back on health, a health-related question, and we get them every day and please keep them coming and we'll always try to answer them. And as we get more, we will just grow the team. We'll just keep expanding. All right, today I want to talk about uh, light and and red light therapy, and the reason why I'm doing that is because it is the middle of winter, and you're not getting a lot of light. Uh, If you're in Canada, obviously, if you're in Australia, New Zealand, South America, you're getting lots for the southern U.S., uh, and we have people listening from there, but, you know, a lot of the audience is Canadian and American and and some U.K., um, most of it, anyhow. So, you know, light therapy, again, middle of winter. A lot of people are lacking in it, and there's there's some great science and literature out there uh, that will help you and devices that will help you get your proper light therapy. I'm always a huge advocate, as you guys know, getting it from food, getting it from you know going outside in nature, as I just said, uh, supplementation where need be. Lord knows we've done enough shows on that. But also there's, there's science and technology that will help out, and I'm a huge, huge proponent of devices that are effective and good and made by good, strong companies. So I'll get to that at the end. Now, what about light? All right, I'm going to give you some a little bit of science here, a little bit of a little bit of literature. I have to do because it's important, and I get the question a lot. How does light affect you and your blood? Light acts at the cellular level by stimulating the cells to generate more energy and utilize oxygen more effectively. Within certain blood-based cells, exist the mitochondria. You call them the powerhouses, folks. I've said this on many shows. They produce cellular energy in the form of a molecule called adenosine or adenosine for you people, triphosphate or ATP. The enzyme in the mitochondria known as cytochrome C oxidase, so it's CCO, utilizes the light photons to increase the ATP and reduce the oxidative stress. There's a cascade of mitochondrial and intercellular downstream effects um, that lead to improved tissue repair, reduced inflammation, and this process also creates mild oxidants, ROS, that lead to both cellular repair, healing, and gene transcription. Lots of PubMed resources and references there, so I'm not just spewing out stuff for you people to just say, okay, Mike, get on with it. I'm almost there, guys. I'm almost there. Stay with me, team. Multiple studies in Russia, China, Brazil, Germany, their specific frequencies and intensities of light delivered directly into the blood that include environments in lipid levels and cholesterol, improved blood sugar levels, better clotting, reduction of arthritic pain, and fibromyalgia symptoms, um, that, and then even increased immunity. So light hits the blood, decreases inflammation, allows for enhanced cellular energy production, and boom, that is why most people will feel better. Same thing when they go for a walk in the sunshine, when they're in the beach, uh, and that's why most plants also die without light. Light is really important. I, I mean, I'm str- I think that most people know that. I mean, I, I assume they do, but I shouldn't. Uh, get outside, get as much as you can, get the light in you. Uh, you know, of course you take precautions and don't go out for six hours in a row. You know, go out for 20, 30 minutes, go inside, go under a tree, just get outside. I went with the, you know, the dead of the wind, the dead of the summer, sorry, when it's really hot. But light is really important. And I mean, it has been my whole life. I, you know, even when I'm doing proposals, I'm working uh, from home. And if there's time, I will go sit outside with my laptop and do some work and get the light. It's just incredible. All right. I, ha- I do work with athletes. I've worked with many athletes, uh, high-level professional athletes on this, and, and they have used light to increase their athletic performance. But think about this. The worst thing you can do for your physical and mental performance is literally spend your day inside with no light, no working out, you know, not no nature, just sitting inside, usually spending countless hours on your iPhone or your iPod or whatever device you have inside. Not good. In sports medicine, and we own one ourselves, photobiomodulation has 
demonstrated increased exercise capacity, longer exercise times, improved biomarkers. I test for that as well too. I've looked at biomarkers, um, but some are you know lactate, creatine, kinase, CRP. I've tested for all those in people, um, you know, and you can see the, the improvements and the and the noticeable increase using light therapy uh, to improve these markers. All right. Also, healing with light, phototherapy. It's gaining more and more acceptance across different medical professionals. It's funny because I say this is that my talking to my mom and we were at my mom's last night to, to drop something off to her, you know, a laptop for her, and she was just saying, you know, Mike, the the red light panel has been extremely beneficial for her. It's improved arthritic pain. It's improved energy. La la. And she'll mention it to her medical providers, right? Like this is a true story. So she'll mention it to her her physiotherapist or whoever she sees doctor and, and they don't know anything about it. So they have, most of them haven't heard anything about light therapy or red light devices. Um, and even one, she said, she joked and I laughed, but to each his own, they said, this lady's putting us out of business. These devices or the therapy she's getting on her own is putting us out of business. Okay. That, that can be facetious and said in jest, but at the end of the day, I'm all about you people listening to this call, improving your life. When I say get better every day and give you the tools to improve yourself and get better, right? So I want you guys to be the best version of yourself. Number one, go outdoors when you can. It's free. Get the sunlight where you can. Get your light. Get your nature. Play whatever. Free. That's number one. Number two, can't. You can go to certain areas to get photobiomodulation, red light therapy, near infrared light therapy. Because there's been so many benefits, right? Um, and I've talked about wavelengths before, the different nanometers, you know, 400, 550, 650, 850, and so on, and the different spectrums of red light and near infrared and near infrared light, and the differences. You can go back to previous podcasts to understand that, but uh, it's been around for a long time. It's got many healing benefits. Uh, NASA has been using it for so long. They've been using infrared light many, many, many years ago, uh, especially with their astronauts. Uh, National Cancer Institute as well is, is working with light for tumors. Um, you know, they're looking at photosensitive drugs, which kill different types of cancer cells. There's different lengths, as I said, penetrating the skin, red light penetrates about an inch deep. I and mean, I've talked about this before, so I'll give it here without producing heat, um, improves blood circulation, relaxes the stiff, painful muscles. And, you know, here's some, here's some of the claims. They're not mine. I've seen them personally, but also this is in the articles and stuff. It can improve acne, eczema, scarring, burns, skin cancer, cold sores, rosacea, that stimulates collagen producing cells for your healthier looking skin. Just look it up, right? You guys can do that here. Um, all right. That is all I want to get through today. The next logical question I always get, Mike, what about where do we get these devices if we want to get a red light panel? Many of my clients and patients have them, right? They have, they, they I don't know, maybe dozens own them. Uh, again, we own them. Family members own them. They're great couple of companies um, that, that we've um, done work with before in the past and promoted their products. Uh, the Juve, geez, probably four or five years now. J-O-O-V, so J-O-O-V-V, the Juve. Um, we own one, right? So I said my, my mom owns one, my aunt owns one, my brother owns one, everybody owns them, right? They're really good. Uh, you can go there to Juve um, and get yourself a red light panel. I think they're actually offering a discount right now of $300 off. You can reach out to us. You can email the team here. We'll give you a link to go over there and uh, and you can get a discount. And the second one is a new one on board. And and I'm only going to go on what people have mentioned to me, uh, not my own personal clients, but uh, the Rouge uh, Rouge Red Light Panel seems to be good. The literature looks good on it. Um, I don't own one. You know, some clients are just acquiring them now because they are Canadian based and they, they're easier to get a hold of in Canada, which means they ship a lot quicker in Canada. So if you're Canadian, you can look at the Rouge red light panels. Do you always do your homework? Guys, please, girls, do your homework. Look them up. See if they work for you. I know we use ours daily. We love it. I'm sharing information with you. That's what I do. And clients seem to love them, right? That's why. So you can reach out to us as well too, Rouge. I think they'll offer you a 10% discount as well. Just email us, guys, and we'll send you these links. So the team will send you the links uh, to save you a buck. That's all we can ever do is, is, is help you guys save some money. That's why I don't get in the supplement business, so I don't sell supplements, guys. Um, I don't want to make money off selling supplements for anybody. I will always give my discount to them, uh, max level, for people to get you know, supplements or whatever they can get at a good, cost-effective price. It's just the way we work, and I don't own a company on it. I don't want to. I don't want to make money off them. So you guys just get the benefits of getting the insight of studying. 
give you an example. I just ran on the treadmill for 30 minutes. What am I listening to? Different doctors talking about different therapies, devices, uh, immune system function, etc. I want to learn so we can help you guys. That's why we do the show. Learn, learn, learn. Help you guys so you can get more information, become more educated, do your homework always, and then make good decisions. That's it. Because uh, if not, we can just do it ourselves and I can keep it all in and, and hopefully we have a nice, healthy, vibrant family doing well. But then I don't feel like my obligation is to share I'm not sharing it with the world. Because that's what I'm going to lead to in a second about what your purpose is in this world. All right. First book, Transformation from Within. It's free. We wrote it. It's free. It's on the website, MikeDasic.com. Being revamped right now. I've said it in the previous podcast. MikeDasic.com is being revamped. It should be done by March. It'll be a new and improved website. Uh, there we go. Um, How to Restore Your Health. Second book. You can get it anywhere. Anywhere in the world. Barnes & Noble, Kobo, iBook, Walmart, Target, How to Restore Your Health by Mike Dasiak. Love it. You can grab it. I think it's 150 pages. It's a small, short read. I think you can do it in a day. Um, that's the intent of creating the book. So something quick. I know how the world works these days. They want quick hitters. All right. There we go. And you know what I say. Again, I'll get the email because I will get this question. The email, info at MikeDasiak.com. So I-N-F-O at M-I-K-E-D-A-C-I-U-K.com. Interactivebodybalance.com is also the website. All over there, guys. Go, go, please, and uh, enjoy. What I tell my kids every day, you guys know this. I've been listening to this for five, probably five years now, I think, podcast, six years maybe. I don't know, a long time. So I tell my kids every day, kids, you got to work hard. No laziness. Don't stand for laziness. You got to work hard. You have to put in the work. I don't like lazy people. It's not that I don't like them. I just don't understand it, right? You, you're in this world for 10, 20, 30, 50, 90 years. I don't know. Please work hard. Number two, Right? Add your skill set, as I said, with the world. Add your value. You've got a gift, a talent. You have to share it with the world. That's why I said I'm sharing these podcasts with the world because it's a way of getting the message out there to help people who are struggling. And and I said because I'm telling you every day, multiple emails, texts, questions on people who are struggling. Multiple. Every day. This weekend, I think there were seven or eight, literally, that came in over the weekend. So I know people are struggling. Right, That's just a fact. So these are to help you. You know that we love you. We want to we want to take care of you and provide guidance to you. That's the intent of the heart. All right. Number three, I guess it kind of goes together to help other people, but in the sense of pull out chairs, open doors, volunteer, so give of your effort. You know, coach teams, go to you know soup kitchens, whatever you can do. Right. Give of your money. If you can give money to charities to help people out, right. Donate charities. I don't know whatever works for you guys. Give your money. Number four, and this is a big one. Smile and have some fun. Because when you're doing all this and you're fulfilling your life purpose and mission, sometimes people don't have enough fun. And they're not smiling as much as they should or they're too into their business. Okay? Team, live with passion, live with purpose, live with intent. I hope this helped you. That's why we do it. And uh, we'll talk to you guys sooner than later. Bye for now.